Hello, people. Just wanted to say hi to all my good friends that are on here. That You know, the people I don't even know, but I talk to them, and they seem like friends. <laughs> you know, so I, I, I want to shout out to Trey. He's a good guy. <laughs> and you get to meet, when you get to meet somebody, like, in real life, that was, like, one of your activist friends or one of your friends that you meet online, like, I met this girl one time that we followed each other for a long time and then I met her and it was like the greatest feeling to finally meet somebody so I have this um, woman that I follow Rose and I've been following her for years and uh, she's big on the true crime shout out Rose and uh, <laughs> she's so funny she really is funny she does all these accents <laughs> So I was going to ask her to, like, imitate my accent because I get so much, um, people always make fun of me all the time about my accent. So I was going to ask Rose if she could do my accent, but she probably would do it like a New Yorker. <laughs> I heard her New Yorker or her New Jersey accent. I don't know how she does it, but she's hilarious. And she lives in Maine, and I was like, man, I would freaking love to meet her and, like, She's always working so hard. I was like, I would help her. But anyway, so I make this rose water, okay? <clears throat> it still looks really good. I only got one bottle. But do I have more? I, I have little, little spritzers that I made to spritz on your face. Um, but I'll tell you, this stuff is so good for your hair. Like as a hair rinse. I tried it the other night. I was like, I'm going to rinse this. I, so I just put it in a cup and I just rinsed it while I was in the tub in my hair. And... I, I don't know what it does, but I'll tell you, this stuff will make, it makes your skin feel like um, silk. When you when you use it like an astringent. Um, yeah, I try to sell it, but I'll get ahead of my little. I try to sell it, but up north, I had like four bottles or something, but you know, I had a yard sale and it was funny. I had a yard sale and I was like, I don't know. It, I don't know what happened, but it was just like it was just like nosy people stopping like that nobody was gonna buy anything right and I had this biker chick stop and she's like oh yeah oh she's like I don't know she was like being friendly but like in a like a weird way so she was like oh she oh she's an artist and I was like I never I never claimed to be an artist uh, I don't consider myself an artist but the way she said it oh she think and then I was like yeah I was trying to sell that she goes yeah nothing sells and like these people stopped and they were asking me about the real estate and I was telling about how Stanley was asking, how much he was asking for the room and it didn't, I said I don't even have an oven and I didn't have, I didn't have a regular refrigerator or a regular oven or anything and um, I was just telling them the story about it but yeah nobody, I sat out there, I don't know how long, I sat out there, I had some nice stuff, I had, I sat out there and I don't know. I couldn't even give my flowers away for free. Like literally put a table out there with my flowers and um, some plants and stuff and put a free sign. And uh, so I don't know. I guess I was, I guess I was the bad person in the, in the town. I was like, don't buy anything from her. She's, she's on some kind of a list or something. Uh, to just stop and ask her questions and be nosy and, you know, don't buy anything. And I don't know. I don't know. It's like, oh, look at her flowers. Like, why would anybody want free flowers? I don't know. I couldn't even give my flowers away for free. And they were gorgeous. So, whatever. I don't even care. But these people commenting, it's like, I like to know why it's always men. Like, it could be, maybe it's not men. But they were all, like, I, I keep track of all the names. And it's always men. So it's like, wow. Are these, like, are these like men that are out there to target women? What is it? 